Hi, I'm Ted. Today I'm going to show you how to remove contents from selected cells in Excel. I have a just a, a goofy spreadsheet I made here uh, just to illustrate the point. Um, so it's just three columns and, and several rows. And what I'm going to do is first I'm going to show how to delete one line, one, one row. To do that, you simply select the rows. But, but to do that, select the number at the left-hand side of the row. And then you can just go edit, delete, and that deletes, deletes the row. Now I'm going to undo that. And let's just see what happens when we actually, instead of selecting the row, we select just the items in the row, not the entire row. And we go to edit, delete, and now, because we haven't selected a whole row, it wants us to know, do we want to shift the cells up? In other words, once, once this information has disappeared, do we want everything below it to go up, or do we want everything to the right of it to go to the left? Well, in this case, of course, we want everything to go up, and we say OK. Now, let's undo that again, and let's say we want to just delete one item here. So let's, we're going to delete this one here, and we're going to go edit, and we're going to go to delete, and it wants to know, do we go, want to go left or up? Well, we don't want either. We want to just delete the information there. So instead of delete, the, the correct thing to do here is clear. And we're going to clear the contents. So we, we, we go to the clear menu, contents, and that just makes the information there disappear and doesn't affect anything anywhere else on the spreadsheet. Uh, you can also do that. We'll just click on another one. If you just click on the cell, and just hit the delete key on your keyboard and then a return, it accomplishes the same thing. So I hope this has been helpful. I'm Ted and today I showed you how to delete selected content on a spreadsheet in Excel. Thank you for watching.